Aquarius, this is Jackie Talman. This is your general reading. This is for the week of September 5th, 2022. Thank you guys for stopping by. Uh, happy Labor Day. I hope you're having a great time. Uh, don't forget that this week of September 9th, running through October 2nd, is Mercury Retrograde. This is a time frame of the unexpected, so just be aware of that. Now, this week, um, could be dealing with the Sagittarius Energy or Virgo. Okay, um, someone you know, someone close to you coming in for an unexpected offer of help. Some kind of confirmation or clarity is coming into you. There is a high drive for success as well as a trip out of state. Moving forward and a lot of healing energy. So let's start here with the Wheel of Fortune. Wheel of Fortune says that wheel is turning into your favor. Uh, this is good luck and abundance. This could also indicate a partnership. Some in work, some in your personal life, and for some of you, it's going to be both. Then we have the Eight of Swords. Eight of Swords is the card of self-imposed restrictions. Now, Aquarius, it says no one is holding you back this time but you, and you really need to push forward. We have the Nine of Coins. Nine of Coins comes in with financial independence. This could be money coming from something you've been waiting on, like uh, maybe you've cashed in an investment. It could be a settlement. It could be an inheritance. Excuse me. Anything to that nature that has been put off. But I think this money you know about. Okay. We have the Knight of Cups. Knight of Cups comes in with an unexpected offer. And we have the King of Swords. Could be dealing with someone with a sharp tongue. Someone um, someone who might get a little catty with you. I don't see a confrontation. I'm going to say maybe like a know-it-all energy is what I'm looking at. And for some of you, a Libra may or may not uh, resonate here. We have the Seven of Pentacles. And that Seven of Pentacles says, you know, this is um, watching your money grow. This could also indicate bonus commission checks, raises, and or promotions. And we have the Pope. Pope comes in as the person that comes in to save the day. This is a take charge type person, a person with a plan. You've got the Magician, the highest card in the deck. This trumps your entire reading, saying you get everything you want and desire right there on the table before you. With the King of Wands, this is you taking authority, okay? Could be dealing with an Aries as well, but this is you putting your foot down and you being true to yourself. Now, let's move forward with these messages for the week of September 5th for my Aquarius. Okay, Aquarius, we have the Four of Pentacles. Four of Pentacles is asking you to keep some things to yourself. Thoughts, ideas, and opinions, keep them to yourself right now. King of Wands, okay? This is an Aries energy. Actually, you've pretty much had all the fire signs here, which is Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. You may be dealing with any of those this week. Uh, but this is the same as here. You have the King of Wands of putting your foot down and being true to yourself. We have the Three of Wands. You're looking back over the past, and what you're doing is you're trying to see what worked well and what didn't work well, and you're pulling from that energy. We have the Seven of Cups. Seven of Cups says, no quick decisions. You've got plenty of options ahead. Okay, so slow down and think things through. But this is also saying that what you've been manifesting, and I'm going to say a lot of you since the first year, is now coming to fruition. Okay? We have the Lover's card in the center of the reading. You want to be strong in love, whether you are a couple or single. And on that Seven of Pentacles, we have the Moon. Now, the Moon comes in as divine timing. It means everything has to line up and fall into place for the next event to occur. The Pope comes in with the Three of Swords, okay? Uh, three of Swords, Three is a crowd, third person. I want advice and or opinions. And on the Magician card, you've got the Justice card, okay? Justice coming in to your favor, restoring your balance. For some of you, it's a financial balance. Uh, for others, it's the signing of a legal contract and or document or a court win. And we have the King of Cups coming in with the unexpected offer of love. I'm using the word unexpected. And a Cancer energy may resonate. 
bonus card is the Queen of Pentacles coming in with total and complete financial stability with another Aquarius. You're either dealing with another Aquarius, and I also have to say there is a bit of stubbornness here. Um, this is you standing your ground, you not wanting to bend, you not wanting change, okay? So that is for the week of the 5th. You guys are seeking your personal reading at JackieTomlin.com. You have a great evening, and I'll see you soon. Bye.